Eight years ago, Square Enix launched Kingdom Hearts Key, a browser game that officially served as the eighth game in the series and a prequel that takes place centuries before anything else. It told of the events leading to the Keyblade War, which was something only referenced in other games. It was only released in Japan, that is, until 2016 when its sequel, Kingdom Hearts Unchained Key, was released for mobile devices. As the official ninth game in the series, this partially retells and adds new plot elements to the original story and continued it for five years. It was later rebranded as Kingdom Hearts Union Cross, so this X thing changed from the Greek letter key to just a uh, cross, I guess. Anyway, the rebranding meant nothing for the story, they literally just updated the app one day and it had a new title. Unchained Key, Union Cross, whatever you want to call it, it's a story of war, betrayal, rebellion, mystery, cold-blooded murder, and it shows us other sides of familiar characters from the mainline games. How are they here when this takes place centuries in the past? Well, I don't know. See, within the Kingdom Hearts community, there's basically two differing opinions on this game. One group is obsessed and feels the story is way more interesting than the current mainline weird meta commentary that KH3 is going for, and the other group says, Ew, mobile game. I guess I'm somewhere in the middle because this story is interesting, but I'd be a billion times more interested if it was delivered to me in literally any other medium. No one can deny this is a basic pay to win, money grubbin, microtransaction having, always online, artificially difficult, sin against God, gotcha game. Whoa! This is worthless. It's less than worthless, my boy! There are over 970 levels in this game, and we've been drip fed a couple levels a month for five years, most of which are completely irrelevant Disney World filler. I'll admit though, it's cool we got a Wreck-It Ralph world. Still, I can't blame anyone for avoiding this game no matter how big a fan of the series they are. But when we got that big scene at the end of KH3, that should have been your hint that the mobile game matters and isn't going away anytime soon. Oh. But wait, I don't get it. Why would they... Why would they shut this? They didn't even wait a day before announcing two new mobile games based on Final Fantasy VII the same day they announced Union Cross was shutting down. I see. I see what you're doing. You know though, this is actually great news because it means the story can finally end. They have no choice. They can no longer string us along with filler. It's time for this five year journey to be over. How will Ventus and the rest of those guys get to the future? What is the Master of Masters planning? What is in Lushu's box? What is darkness? Will any of these questions be answered? Probably not! But I'm gonna find out. I'm gonna play it right now. The finale of Kingdom Hearts Union Cross. Welcome to the end of Union Sauce. I'm a little bit upset. That intro you just watched, I edited 10 days ago because I edited it on the night we knew it was coming to Japan. And both American and Japan have been synced for a long time. And everybody just assumed, everybody told me, oh yeah, 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 it's coming in Japan. It's also gonna come in America. It didn't. I waited 10 days, I narrowly avoided the spoilers, and then out of nowhere today they just said, yeah, 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 it's here in America now. So I don't know if this is old news, but it doesn't matter. Because it's here now, and I didn't get spoiled, so that's nice, that's real cool. I am actually legitimately excited for this app ending. It could, like, lead <laughs> directly into Kingdom Hearts 4, for all we know. The biggest thing I'm curious about, I mean, I asked a few questions at the end of that thing there, but like, what's gonna happen to this guy? What's gonna happen to Tom? <laughs> like, you're the main character in the story and you're fully customizable, you're a guy or a girl, and you have a name. So 
you can't be referenced in future games, right? You can't have Sora go like, oh, remember when Tom saves the day? It can't happen. Everybody's character is different. You can't even really say he or she. Maybe you can say they, but that's like so vague. What I'm saying is, I think this guy's gonna die. The question is, how? I hope it's cool. I hope you live on it's like some ancient legend that's forgotten by all but like I guess the rest of the survivors of this game. That's what I'm looking forward to. I'm looking forward to some reveals, something to happen, something that makes this <laughs> worth it. For five years, I've waited long enough. It's time to go in. I kind of barely remember what happened last time. You, the gang gets together, some of them are getting sent to the data world. Me and the gang are being left behind. We killed darkness. I think it was the final boss. Oh, this is an actual level with a boss. The final battle. Okay, that's bad because now I gotta actually kill the final boss. Well, let's, let's, let's do it. Uh, break out the lady luck. Yeah. Yeah, that'll work. Uh, I'll take, I'll take loose shoes. Yeah. Here we go. The world is going to end. Oh, yeah. He has the coolest theme. <laughs> this theme playing right now, the Master of Masters theme. Just pure chaos. Oh, yeah. Okay, so he's giving loose shoes the box. That's what's happening. Everyone's gonna die, light will expire. The old prophecy. That happens with KH3. Oh, I'll get started then, okay, bye. I think this was in the movie, the Union Cross back cover thing. So they're just retelling it. <gasps> Wait. Never mind. I was thinking of something else. <laughs> There's this in this scene in the movie. He whispers something to Lushu and you don't hear it, but that already happened, so I guess they're not going to tell us what it was. Great. Huh. So where's the form come from, though? How does one person have a form and one doesn't? And now the form must want to take over, okay. You can't destroy darkness if it has no form. That's what I did in the last level. Uh oh, that's bad. <laughs> I know how it sounds, but believe me when I say that I didn't train you all just to turn you into vessels. I pushed you to become resilient. This was your plan? 13 darknesses. Do we know what he's talking about? Because there's like a, a few different 13 things. So I'm guessing these five plus, plus Lushu? Seven hearts. Oh yeah, there's seven here. Was that me? But was that me? <laughs> so is his plan to kill darkness? I thought his plan was a little more evil or chaotic. What's in the box? What's in the box? Come on, mom. <laughs> Naturally, I'm confused with Kingdom Hearts. Oh, he's just talking about generic Heartless. So five of them will fit in the unions. And the last one will turn. Okay. You can't. The sacrifice. I told you. <laughs> I know that all too well. Oh, backstory. Yo, this is the first time Master Master has, like, humanity. He knows loss. We didn't know that. Meanwhile, we are literally gonna die. See, I forgot where I was. <laughs> I thought I was with these guys. Oh, I'm with Ephemer. Okay, okay. It makes sense that these two are jumping the machine since they're in the future. They kind of need to live. 
Or maybe they die and their their nobody versions come out from that. I don't know. He's trying to save us. I'm sorry, Brain. I can't be saved. I'm a customizable character. I'm dead. It would be cool if Marluxia and Larkseen remember this at some point. You like awaken it or whatever. Who? Wow, I never talk. Ha ha ha, we know brain. Ha ha, we are friends. I can't believe the world is... <laughs> Wow, they're just casually... Yeah, it's kind of quiet with the world ending and all. Guys! Look out! It's... The final boss. Is this what the Master was talking about? Is this how Kingdom Hearts the first one happens with each darkness like eats a world? That's kind of cool. Fools. Dude, I'm not going to be the one to survive. <laughs> you got to get that through your head. Fools. <gasps> what? What's going on? <laughs> Oh my god. Oh, no! <laughs> no, this is not how I wanted it to happen. Tom's heart is lost to darkness. Is the final boss me? <laughs> Tom. How's this gonna work? Am I gonna do my own dive to heart thing where I fight myself? Or am I gonna fight Ephemer? Oh my god. Okay. Yeah, use that. Yeah, I know what I'm doing. Yeah, 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 use that. Hold on. Namaste. I'm kinda not doing damage. I'm kinda not doing damage. Oh, okay, I'm doing damage there. Yeah, 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 yeah. Yes. Oh, good lord, I'm not doing enough, though. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six. Is that, what is that? 29 million bars of HP? Yeah, I can take them. That didn't do anything. I'm gonna use you. That didn't do anything. Cool. Very cool. I'm not. I'm not doing anything. Oh my god, no! Don't do this. Not on the final boss. <laughs> well, you know what? Money is worthless, so I'm gonna continue. I will kill you, Ephemer. Except you appear in Kingdom Hearts 3, so you s will survive somehow, and this battle will probably be pointless. If you think I know what these attacks do... <laughs> oh, you naive non-Union Cross player. Nobody knows what this does. Oops, didn't mean to do that. That's okay. That's oh fine. See, basically I'm just gonna keep reviving until I can't anymore. <laughs> Because I'm not gonna I'm not gonna deal with this game anymore. I'm just gonna beat him. It's gonna it's gonna take a while. It's gonna take a long time, huh? You think I care? You think I care, Ephemer? I'm darkness now. I am darkness. You cannot defeat me, I am formless. 
Oh my god, this is gonna take so long. I should stop recording at this point. Bruh, 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 moment. Bruh, moment. Alright, I just beat him. After many continues, many retries. Also, look at these achievements. Complete within one turn. Must be out of your damn mind. Okay. Quest complete. I killed them. <laughs> I killed them. It's gonna be something where it's like, yeah, you beat us in battle, you didn't kill us. Uh because FMR appears in Kingdom Hearts 3. Don't give me any of that clone stuff. Me turning evil is something I didn't really expect, but I guess it makes sense. If only. Stop, Tom. <laughs> Let your hatred grow. <laughs> oh no! Ah! Don't unlock my heart. What the heck did you just do? What did you do? How have you not done that before? Excuse me, Ephemer? Meanwhile... Please actually tell me who you are because there's a million people in a black coat. Mushu. Okay. The traitor. Yeah, 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 no, no, no. <laughs> Brain is such a dumb name. Brain, are you really trusting this guy? Why would you trust anybody in a black coat? Really? <laughs> Nobody really gets that in this series. I guess Axel is in the black coat. Everybody cuts each other off in this. <laughs> Three of my friends stay behind, and they're, like, basically all dead right now, so... Apparently Tom's evil, it's a whole thing. <laughs> Is he gonna fight Lushu? Why are they cutting each other off? It's so weird. Whoever uses it needs two things at their destination. Someone with memories of them and a vessel to occupy. I got no mem- nobody remembers Tom. I'm dead. I'm dead. So the time travel rules are consistent with the Xehanort business. Yeah, 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 the classic main character of Kingdom Hearts trope. I'll figure it out. I'll, I'll do it. You're pretty smart, aren't you? <laughs> it's a shame this lifeline- I'm not gonna do Zigbar's voice. See, they're not dead. They just lost a battle. I still have no idea what he did. He sent a portal? Like, where did he send us? And what's that? How did those two get there? Was that from Brain? Yeah, I feel like the two of them had to make it somehow. Why do I feel like something horribly wrong is about to happen? He sent me to the Wreck-It Ralph Wi-Fi wire! <laughs> this is the Wi-Fi, like, the entrance to the Wreck-It Ralph world. Are you joking me? Through this portal, we can go to countless arcade games. No, I don't want to waste away. What? Was that the plan? Did we, did me and Ephemer talk about that? As powerful as darkness is, they still need a key to like go places. If you need me, I'll be in Sugar Rush.
Is that how this goes? That whole entire final boss fight was me and him pretending to fight? Did Ephemer really just... Well, he was okay with that? He was like, oh, Tom, you're going to lock yourself forever with the darkness? You want to do that? And I was like, yeah, 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 I'll do that. I can't be canon for the rest of the series, so I have to die. That's true, he shouldn't have brought Chirithi here. Could have just left. Goodbye, Chirithi. <laughs> Is that the Chirithi that you meet in three? Maybe, I don't know. Too many questions. So that's it, everybody escaped the data world, right? I think. Two different worlds traveling back and forth. I don't know. I think we're all in the real world now. Except me. I'm, I'm in that. I'm in Wrecked Ralph. <laughs> in Kingdom Hearts 4, Wrecked Ralph world returns and you find Tom. Keyblade wielder of legend. But where did Brain and Lucian were just there? It looks okay. <laughs> I'm starting to think it's a little dangerous. We should go back. Wow, that's really deep. Someone's gonna stop him. No? They just went outside to look and that was it, okay. <laughs> no, you, you particularly are very difficult to understand, master. I do want to understand. It is very important to do that. Yes. The Road of Twilight? A world of fiction. Here we go. Here we go. We're getting to the Toy Story World stuff from 3. It had to happen. Verum Rex. That little game that you play within the Toy Story World was so important to the series, apparently. So now where are they going? They just came from that. Now are they going to the future? Is that what's happening? Skull, don't cry. It's just the world. I remember when Tom helped me in his stupid Mickey hat. God, what a good guy. I remember when I helped him. Man, that this stuff happened like actually four years ago. Or more. Tom. <laughs> Are we dead? Who is that? Oh, it's just... It's just people. It's just all the Keyblade people who died horribly in the war. We're all dead. Da, 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 da. Ooh, spirits. Wait a minute. Oh, the Cherithes are turning into spirits. I guess that's what they're created for. Right? What is happening? We're connected to the hearts of our Keyblade wielders. When your heart disappears, so do we. Oh. So we're like, we're actually dying. We're dying. And we're turning into spirits? 
If you don't, your heart will simply melt into a new one. Don't tell me I'm going to turn into Sora too. That, oh, that's one of the things that could happen. Also, like, why are we reincarnating the player? I thought, I thought we were supposed to die. Also, like, we're a baby? Where is this? Who is that? You, you mother, no, <laughs> no. Who, who's that? Did he just died? Oh. I, I think I need to make sure I'm interpreting this right. Everybody's, they chose to be spirits, we're being reincarnated, and we turn into baby Xehanort? What is, what is it? It's not over yet. Huh? No! I said, I joked that we would turn into Sora, we're turning into Xehanort. Tom becomes... <laughs> Holy sh! <laughs> Why? It's the- That's it! That's it! <laughs> We're Xehanort and that's it! I can't- How does every Kingdom Hearts game recontextualize every other Kingdom Hearts game Every time! You get us every time, Namura! Everything... <laughs> it just like... The, the main villain of the entire series has just been... Also, it is you from a hundred years ago or whatever. <laughs> It, it's just, it's like every time it makes you want to rewatch every cutscene and go like, was there hints, was there hints, was there hints? I gotta watch the theory videos now. This is a whole thing. Oh. And it ends on that. I'm trying to think of if they ever dropped hints. And I kind of glanced over. The spirits from like Dream Drop Distance are dead children and you can choose to be one of those or become reincarnated and who knows you might you might become the most evil person ever <laughs> oh that's the coolest thing that, that's like it's the dumbest and coolest thing ever because that's kingdom hearts I honestly couldn't be happier. I couldn't be. <laughs> also, we saw Xehanort's mom, I guess? Who was that? Holy. That's amazing. Everything that Xehanort has done is like... A part of him is us. I, I don't even know what to think. I don't even know if I'm completely right about that. I I think I am. You never know. Like again, I gotta watch the theory videos. I gotta see what's going on for real. Ah, <sighs> and that ending, the final scene of Dream Drop Distance, where Sora like meets all the spirits. That was always weird as like a note to end on, but now it's like it changes it. Like I said, it changes it. Oh my god. That's Kingdom Hearts. We did it. I gotta calm down. <laughs> but, but is there a secret? Is there a, is there a cutscene at the end? Is there a post-credit scene? Is there a post-credit scene? Give me the post-credit scene, man. Give it to me. Show me it. Show me it. Oh. 
Is this the world destroyed? Yeah. But who's in the thing? Effie. Tell me he's like the wizard guy from Dark Road. Was that a butterfly? Okay, is that his sister or something? <laughs> Oh, he woke up in a bed of flowers. That's why rose petals are his thing. She woke up in a thunderstorm. That's why she's got electricity. But Ventus woke up nowhere. Who's that? Who's that? Who's that? Lushu? With the box. It looks like it's the same place. We just saw Ventus. May your heart be your gaining key. <gasps> oh wait, well, we knew who we knew who he was. He was Zigbar. Is that young Zigbar? The end. Except there's another scene. <laughs> What is this place? Ooh. Wait. Oh no, that wasn't Zigbar, that was Brain? <gasps> so that's what happened. Brain became the first vessel for Lushu and then... Or Brain is Zigbar. <laughs> I'm an idiot. Of course he's Zigbar, because Zigbar's name was Brag or something, right? They just put the- they changed the N to a G and nobody thought- I never saw a single theory saying that Brain was Zigbar. Brain was Brag. That's why it's a stupid name, because they had to make it work. <laughs> My name is Sigurd. That sounds like a name that can be mixed around. <laughs> Who is that? Sigurd, Sigurd. It was decided. Okay, so you know things. Who are you? Sigurd. Allow me to explain not here so the audience doesn't get to see. No, it's not confusing. This is a cool town. We're gonna get to visit it at some point. Is that? The original Keeper Master and founder of this town, Xehanort? Ephemer. I know, he was a good friend. Should have been Tom. It should have been Tom. Now it's over. That's it. Brain is break. Which is like so obvious. Why didn't anybody think of that? Brain is break. Unless he's not. Unless he's just, I don't know, man. Because like. Wouldn't Bragg know about... No, he definitely was. He definitely does. But then it's like, who's Lushu at that time? So Brain becomes Lushu's next vessel. He turns into Bragg. He turns into Zigbar. <laughs> and the whole thing continues up to now. We still don't know what's in the box. I didn't think that we would find out, but... Still. I'm sure there's a lot more to dissect. But I'm going to have to look up videos first. <laughs> I'm just going to dive into the theory videos right now. This app is done. The app is dead. Well, it'll officially die on June 29th, I think. But for now...
Good night, sweet prince. 